Japan and Britain just merged two fighter jets to build the sixth generation fighter jet. According to three sources, Britain and Japan are close to an agreement to merge their next generation Tempest and FX fighter jet programs, with the two countries aiming for a deal on a new joint project by the end of the year. Reuters stated in a report, will this be the most advanced fighter jet? Well, let's find out. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel Future Warplanes, where we tell you about military fighter jets, military drones, and military planes from the currently famous in the air to the most advanced in the world. So, stay with us till the end of this video because you don't want to miss out on any of this information. And before we proceed, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our amazing videos in the future. And let's dive in! There is a lot of talk these days about stealth fighters. While much of the focus is on the current F-22 and F-35, we rarely hear about new Japanese efforts. According to experts, the FX program Tokyo is currently working on. Despite being bitter enemies during World War II, the island nations of the United Kingdom and Japan have once again built a strong partnership. Even then, British Foreign Secretary William Hague declared in May 2011 that Japan is Britain's closest partner in Asia, and that sentiment remained strong following the visit of the Royal Navy's flagship aircraft carrier HMS Queen Elizabeth last year. During a port call in Yokohama, Japan's defense minister, Nobuo Kishi, and senior Japanese military commanders were shown around the carrier, signaling the beginning of a permanent military presence in a region grappling with China's growing power, according to Reuters last year. In the late 19th century, the British assisted Japan in launching its naval program and even built several warships for the Imperial Japanese Navy. Fast forward to today, and the Japanese military is in talks with the British aerospace and defense contractor BAE Systems to collaborate on the development of a sixth-generation fighter jet that Tokyo hopes to deploy by 2035. It would be the very first time that Japan sought a non-American partner for a large military program, and the first major collaborative effort between Tokyo and London. London, exceeding expectations when industrial talks began five years ago. This would be an equal partnership between Japan and Britain, one source familiar with the plan said. He added that it would cost tens of billions of dollars. The move to combine the Japanese FX program, led by Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, with a British Tempest program managed by BAE Systems by December, has previously gone unreported. The sources requested anonymity because they were not authorized to talk to the media. The main goal is to build a common jet that may have minor differences in design for each country, says another of the sources. Another of the three sources also said Britain could handle European exports while Japan would handle the Asian market. Collaborative effort would spread development costs while exporting would increase production lots and lower per plane prices, allowing both countries to expand their defense budgets. It would signify a strengthening of security ties between the two close U.S. allies. London is increasing its military presence in Asia as part of a strategic tilt toward the Indo-Pacific, while Tokyo is expanding defense cooperation beyond Washington. Japan's policy, driven by late former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe, to enhance Tokyo's hand against neighboring China, has taken on a greater urgency in the aftermath of Russia's invasion of Ukraine, and something that Moscow describes as a special operation. The shift to a European partner comes as Japan's defense spending goes up, with the budget expected to double over the next decade as Prime Minister Fumio Kishida sticks to Abe's natural security agenda and fulfills an election pledge to substantially support military outlays. We would like to decide how we can cooperate by the end of the year, Japan's defense ministry said. The British Ministry of Defense had no immediate comment. Air Chief Marshal Mike Wigston, the country's Air Force commander, told a press conference on Thursday that Britain is exploring exploring partnering opportunities and sharing our technological expertise with a range of international partners, including Japan and Italy. MHI and BAE did not respond to requests for comment. Another source said that Britain intends to provide an update on Tempest at next week's Farnborough Air Show. Japan's collaboration with the United Kingdom provides an opportunity for BAE and other European Tempest companies, such as Rolls-Royce, missile manufacturer MBDA, and Italian defense group Leonardo to enter a growing market long dominated by American firms. Attempts to merge the fighter jet projects come after years of increased collaboration between the UK and Japan, ranging from the JNAAM missile project to sensor work and a deal to develop an engine demonstrator. You can see the trajectory, said Douglas Berry, senior fellow for the military aerospace at the ISS Think Tank. 
It has been more than 20 years since MHI, the manufacturer of the World War II era Zero Fighter, and the U.S. defense firm Lockheed Martin Corp collaborated to build Japan's F-2 fighter, a short-winged derivative of the F-16 Fighting Falcon. Lockheed, which eventually developed the F-35 stealth fighter, was also expected to assist MHI in the development of the FX, an F-2 replacement that Japan hopes to deploy in the 2030s to counter advanced Chinese fighters. The cost of developing the FX is estimated by Japanese Defense Ministry officials to be around $40 billion, with $700 million allocated this year, making it a lucrative proposition for Japanese companies that have lost out as Tokyo purchased American equipment, including the F-35. The government's allocated $2.38 billion to the BAE-led Tempest project to develop a replacement for the European Typhoon combat jet until 2025, when full development is expected to begin. It is one of two European efforts for the next generation of air power, the other being the Franco-German-Spanish future combat air system, which is currently bogged down in disagreements between partners Airbus and Dassault Aviation. Lockheed proposed using an F-22 Raptor airframe and F-35 components for the FX in 2018, but that tentative partnership ended this year because Washington could dictate when and how Japan maintained and upgraded its planes, according to the sources. According to a Lockheed spokesperson, any questions about the program should be directed to the Japanese government. For Japanese firms, which were prohibited from exporting weapons outside of Japan until 2014, the partnership represents an opportunity to gain access to international markets and European technology, with potentially minimal restrictions than those imposed by Washington. Tempest, according to defense analyst Francis Tuza, is a flexible construct that leads itself to multiple forms of cooperation. To ensure interoperability with U.S. forces, the fighter will still require some U.S. components such as communications and data links. As negotiations in Tokyo and London continue, it's unclear what role, if any, the Swedish and Italian governments will play in the new project following their agreement to collaborate on Tempest. So what about Tempest other partners? The Tempest program is a collaboration between Italy, Sweden, and the United Kingdom, with the latter clearly dominating project decisions. While merger talks between Tokyo and London continue, it's unclear where this leaves Rome and Sweden. Italy expressed interest in participating in the Japanese FX program some time ago, but perhaps it was a ruse to bridge the gap between the two programs. Furthermore, the Swedish Defense Material Administration, or FMV, recently hired Saab to conduct research on the development of future fighter aircraft. It is unclear whether Sweden intends to pursue the Tempest all the way, as it would be a high-performance twin-engine fighter, a first for an air force that has traditionally relied on single-engine fighters. It's unclear what role Italy and Sweden will play if Japan joins as another majority partner, similar to the role played by the United Kingdom. And that's it for today's video. Hey, we sincerely hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please click on the like button and share this video with your friends and family. If you have any further questions or comments, please share them with us in the comment space below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to see even more of our incredible videos. You can also check out other videos that have been specially selected just for you. And we'll catch up in the next one. Thanks for watching.